Omaha. I'd like to get into Dallas tonight if I can. I'd like to pick up Dallas and Surrey. I think that'd be a, a be a productive evening. Um, so let's see if we can get done with Devonshire. Mm -hmm. Take the work in progress down because Devonshire is no longer a work in progress. That's for sure. Oh, Camo, they're going to lose that game. It's fine. It's tier three, man. Who cares? I played tier four already, DBF. You weren't here. It's not my fault you're late. If you were on time, we wouldn't have these discussions. All right, what do we got? We got a tier eight game. Fabulous. Devonshire loves tier eight games. <laughs> the only thing I got going for me in this game is standard battle, and it's north. So I can go snuggle up to the bottom end of the cap and hug islands and hopefully be useful. That's about all I can really do. We'll see how it goes. But no, I'm not. I didn't play Phoenix. I, if that's what you're, if that's what you're asking, DBF. No, I reset the American Light Cruiser Line, free XP to Omaha, and played a game in Omaha. Played a hilarious game in Omaha. Now that I think on it. I mean, yes. If I'm gonna get a CV, I'd rather get a tier six CV. I do just fine dealing with those planes. It's the tier eight CV. Like the last time I played Devonshire, and this I put this game on the channel last week. I shot down a bunch of Shokaku planes, but he molested me pretty hard. <laughs> like that felt terrible. Um. And I eventually did not win that. I, he did eventually kill me, but I torpedoed him to end the game, and so that that felt okay. It was like my revenge, right? You keep you keep you keep thinking that DBF. You keep thinking that, buddy. Whatever helps you sleep at night, because God knows you need the help, don't you? No, probably don't. Miss H is pretty good. Derbyshire AA is pretty good for the tier. I think what surprised me was that even London's AA is not terrible. I mean, you don't get defensive fire, but um. You get, uh, you still get, like, uh, I'd say probably 65% of Devonshire's mid-range AA mounts, which is pretty good. Lenius, I haven't had a game yet worthy of a full-on analysis like that, but as, I mean, we just got these ships back on Monday. So, as I play them over the weekend into next week, I might, that might happen. Especially, it's most likely to happen to probably at the high end of the line. If I, I'm likely to get a decent game in, like, maybe the 8, 9, or 10. Um, mini sub, I like that, that's good. Um, I feel like I'm likely to get a decent game up there. Like, I had a Holland game that I turned into a scuttlebutt, but for a while I considered doing that as a battle report just to kind of talk through how I played the ship, how I outfitted the ship, how I played the ship, and why I played it that way. Um, so I'll prob what I'll probably do is I'll keep... One we don't have Holland right now. Um, Ostergotland is probably the, the closest that I can do because Ostergotland and Holland are almost clones of each other. There's very few differences between the two of them. So I could probably see if I could swing a decent game in, in Ostergotland and and then do a and, and you know if I can get a decent one I'll talk through it. The other thing that I don't like about Devonshire is like I I know that I'm not gonna be able to get reliable sits at this range right like I can't I can't fire at these cruisers with my AP because I just won't get it. Yeah, tier 6 AA against tier 8 planes in general feels pretty inadequate. What is even happening on the one line? What is even happening? They're not shooting at each other. What are you guys trying to torpedo each other? Is our Nevni a bot? He acts like he drives like a bot. Yep, he's a bot. Come on, Ryujo. Come on, Ryujo. I got something for you, buddy. Bring it on. Power on. Now it's time to kick some ass. Ooh, you swallowed some flack. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have told you that. Well, the good news is they're beating the crap out of this Massachusetts. I have to shoot over the island, but let's see if we can chime in. I don't think I got over the island with that one. Nope, he's moving up too quick.
I see this all the time. People that drive their Massachusetts like they are immune to damage. I just don't understand. Excellent, Lenny's. I'm glad you like those. I appreciate that. They're honestly, like, I love doing those battle report ones because, to me, those are far more interesting and kind of useful than, than just, like, me just posting a game straight off of Twitch. I feel like there's a lot more that can be learned if people take the time to watch. And the Massachusetts is firing HE. Desert road, no gas. So here's the here's the really good news. I just killed a top tier battleship. So from an XP perspective, that's really good for me. <laughs> Y'all should really kill that Minsk. Like let, let why are the Bismarck secondary should gut that guy like a fish. We got a hell of, we got a Normandy swanning around in their cap. The Bliss is trying to sneak up. Look at that guy. That's right. You take those AP bombs on the Jervis. That's a great idea. So the good news is, is their carrier driver is not good. The bad news is, is that they're going to sweep up this flank over here, and there's pretty much jack all we can do about it. I'll switch to the AP, but I do not expect to get much work out of him at this range. I mean, look how floaty those shells are, and I can't even hit him. Good, I'm glad somebody hit him. I'm going to take my A over here. Uh, this Normandy. Please don't kill me. Uh, that's bad. The Miyoko took a shot at me. Wish you hadn't have done that. Oh, good, he missed. Southern Dragon seems like no 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 okay I gotta get in front I gotta cut these okay I'm gonna be okay I'm gonna be all right the Southern Dragon seems very very ballsy Say hello to my little friend. now we're on now it's time to kick some ass I'm going to eat one torp. That's fine. It's not bad. One aerial torp is not a catastrophe. Well, I have two kills of ships higher tier than me, so that ought to be good for my experience, right? I feel like we should we should need to kill we need to kill that Hatsuharu who's chasing our Bismarck. That guy needs to die. Had the lead right, but he angled away just enough. Those are going to miss. I can guarantee it. Really? Wow, okay. Well, that feels good that we hit him. Yeah. <laughs> the key torpedoed his own destroyer. <laughs> Oh, that's hilarious. All right, our Bismarck is committing suicide. I, I just don't understand why he feels like this is a good idea, but he absolutely seems to. I'm gonna kick your ass, bitch. <laughs> I feel like a total leech, right? I have less than 20,000 damage and two kills. 
in a game that we've got a decent little lead going on in. I need these. I need this. Uh, okay, the Bismarck. The Bismarck's push is is good in a way because he utterly wrecked the Budioni. He burned down the hot suit and he left the Normandy on 6,000 HP. If we can get over here and spot this Budioni, a single HE shell pen will wipe his ass out. I don't know where this Miyoko's gone. There's the Miyoko. I missed him. I don't know how I missed him. We're going to cut through this little island gap here and turn back north. I really am trying to get eyes on the Budioni. Our carrier should finish that guy off. Normandy's turning back north. Let's see if the Ranger can get him. I gotta be frosty. I wanna not get spotted. There's the buddy. There's the Normandy. I want to, I'm going to take a shot on the Normandy right as I lose, right as I go behind this island. No, his, are his guns. Oh, his guns aren't even looking this way. Screw that, then. I'll take a shot now. Because right, if I can get this guy to light, I know his DCP is down. Damn it, I didn't lead him enough. This could hurt. I think he led him right. Eh, it wasn't so bad. Okay, yeah, there's the fire. Please, I need that to stick for a bit. Let's burn a heal now while I've got some... While things are calm, I'm going to burn a heal. The fire's stuck. That feels good. Let's go. Oh my god, this thing is so fat and slow. Did you guys kill that Graf Spey? Yes, please. Kill the Graf Spey, please. Okay. The two ships down here, the three ships I gotta deal with down here are the Miyoko, who's fairly healthy. I, they, I need the battleships to beat him up. The Normandy is quite low. Normandy's on. Normandy's gonna burn out! Yes! <laughs> and the buddy's on 900 HP. I think I might be able to get into this cap circle. How about that, kids? Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. If I can find the buddy, I'll just wipe him off. I'll wipe him out. I have three kills on 25,000 damage. There's the buddy. I outspot him huge, so there's pretty much nothing he can do about this. Goodbye, sir. All the mocking I did about Devonshire in a tier 8 game kind of feels weird now, doesn't it? This is going to be like, if I could kill this Miyoko, I could have like the lowest damage Kraken ever. <laughs> that would be hilarious. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to keep sailing over towards the Miyoko. I know, right, Linnaeus? We're, I'm going to keep sailing towards the Miyoko. I'm going to get close to him. I'm going to get close enough for my AP to engage. He seems intent on angling towards these battleships so that's we're gonna we're gonna give him that opportunity yeah i led those out and he still managed to yeah, he's gonna look at me that i'm not gonna fire I'm not gonna give him the resets I'll swap back to the HE for the next time I decide I want to take a pop shot. Their CV should be dead soon. Okay, he's coming back. What's my detection? 10-1? 10-1. So he's got some... He's got some space. Oh! I'm totally taking that shot. 1,200! I need like two of these shells to land! Come on! Yes! <laughs> yes! The ultimate vulture! <laughs> A Kraken on 28,000 damage! <laughs> oh 
I don't think I've ever had a Kraken with so little damage. Captain, Captain Killsteel. That is amazing. That is amazing. I love that. <laughs>